I um, like I like I usually say. I almost feel bad about that just because the, the they're so clueless, so clueless. And I mean, it's not like the sky police are necessarily evil. The sky police are actually the good guys. It's just the guy who's controlling them is evil. Hmm. What does this do? Ah, oh, it stops that. Oh, that's actually like perfect timing too. That. And there we go. I think there's another... I think there's somewhere else you can put this as well. To get... Loot, possibly? Hello, loot. Uh, let's see. Oh, no, never mind. I don't need that. Just... Boop, right up here. And there we go. I knew there was loot in this room somewhere. Anyway. Ooh, carrying on. Getting back to the hangar. Oh, look, another one of these. Whee! They don't... I, in my opinion, they didn't use that enough. Uh, they didn't use the G swinging enough. Remotely enough. Although, well, I'll just save that for later. But, um... You know, another thing I have to say about Rochard is it seems like there's a lot of story here that they wanted to tell and just couldn't for whatever reason. Time constraints, budget constraints, something. It seems like there's a lot there they wanted to say, story-wise or gameplay-wise or anything. Just a lot of stuff they wanted to do that they just couldn't. Uh, don't worry about getting off the train because you'll get back on it eventually. Did he just... Did he get lasered in the head by that thing? Come out with your hands up. Here's a little nugget for you. Ow. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I wanted to stick... There we go. Oh, yeah. Now that... Is Skittles. Not really. Enjoy that. I'm going to take this fuse with me. Enjoy that. Nope. No one is here. Didn't even get to finish what he was saying. He just got owned. Oh, this one's got a random box on it. Go, 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 go. Aw, oh, well, I knocked the box off, so that's okay, I suppose. Is there another box in here? Yep. You see nothing. Eat fuse. Oh, skill shot, not really, but whatever. It works. He thinks I'm supposed to go this way now. Take me to your leader, crate. Woo. You know, for a very, a not very active mind, there's a lot of giant boxes coming out of here. Enjoy that. There we go. <laughs> Rochard is so manly, he beats crystals to death with his hands. Even drone explosions can't beat Rochard's, the power of Rochard's fists. Oh, maybe they can't. <laughs> the just random squeal of pain from those guys is just almost ridiculous. Punch. Punch. Oh, hi. Enjoy that. Huh. 
was about to make a crack in there. <laughs> that was very strange. Woo. If you don't know what a kraken is, well, uh, not the mythical sea creature, by the way. Uh, it's basically just a, it's a term for when physics glitch out in a game and legs and limbs just spaz out everywhere. Oh, these guys again. Great. Epic. Dead. Epic fail. You're supposed to kill the robots before you jump over them? Yeah. That didn't work well for me. Let's go, shall we? Oh, right. Kill the robots. Don't. Be nice to them. You go over there. Also. Uh oh. <laughs> uh. Can I jump higher than that? Just barely. Oh, that is not where I wanted to go. Swing my way over here. And in. Wait for me, box. I may have been crushed in between a rock and a hard place. The rock being crystals. Anyway. This wasn't here last time. Like I said, Manly Rochard breaks fit breaks giant crystal outcrops with his fists. Because duh. I, I was trying to come up with a way to to do the the whole do you even lift thing, but with Rochard and giant breaking rocks. Breaking giant rocks with his fists. Get out of here. Don't mind that. Sir, we have the disc and the girl. And Richard? He is dead, sir. You're sure? He has a nasty <laughs> habit of coming back. Positive, sir. He's buried in a mining shaft. They managed to figure out the statue's location. It's in the old mines under the casino. Fantastic news. Apollo, I see a promotion in your future. Meet me at the casino and bring the girl. Mother Apollo? truckers. Apo now how the hell do I get off this rock? Apollo? I need a plan I Damn it. Damn it, Richard. Apollo? I see a box in your future. <laughs> just saying. Just saying, Apollo. Just saying. I see a box in your future. Switchblade. Xander fixed it. Xander, old buddy, I wish you was coming with me. You always did appreciate a good old ass kicking. Now this one's gonna be the mother of them all. Maximilian's gonna get a knuckle sandwich with a side of whoop ass. Hillbillies in space, space, space. I'm in space. That was my horrible impression of the Space Corps. Space. Anyway. I still think, I, I like with the Switchblade, for example, I think there's a lot more story they wanted to tell here and just couldn't. Because, I mean, I want to know what the story is behind this thing. Obviously, Rochard and Xander had it a long time ago, maybe, and it was broken, and Xander fixed it, because he mentioned earlier that he, sw that he fixed it, that he fixed the Switchblade, and it was faster than light, and all that stuff. All, all that good stuff. But, I mean, it seems like there's more they wanted to tell that they didn't get the time to. Or they didn't just didn't get to in general.
there are no words for what just happened. was a masterpiece of silliness. Hmm. That looks grateful. Random bouncing box. Okay. Methinks I should have gone up there. Uh, well, it doesn't look like there's anything I can do to get it back up there now. And I really can't see anything up there, so... I'd laugh if I just missed something bad. Like, super important. It's probably just another health station. Oh, hang on, speaking of a health station. Uh, ah, there we go, got it. Health station, gotta get that health station. Man, look how much health Richard has since we started the game. It's almost like we're progressing towards the end of the game. Imagine that. Hmm. That looks like an up. That looks like a. Like one of these we got. Let's see what it is. Oh man, a Helga! The first generation G lifter! They called these babies doomsday machines because they could lift anything. <laughs> That's weird. How come it's already activated? Hmm. Question. G lifter upgrade to grab humans. Yep. Also, anti-gravity grenade, which is actually incredibly useful right here. Yep. So there goes our old one. Bye. I I'd take you with me if I could, but I can't. Oh, God. Let's go, shall we? Oh, and now there's suddenly dudes. Great. Yes, this is the most ridiculously overpowered thing in the universe. <laughs> Sup? <laughs> just chuck people at people. I mean, that is the that is one of the greatest things ever. Just, I, I wish you could start over like a new game plus and just use this all the time because I would just have so much fun with that. You're coming with me, little buddy. Not really. You stay there. Useful, ain't it? Woof! Eh. Huh. Oh, hey, looky there. Explosion. That's... Huh. It'd be interesting if I could actually get down there and go in that hole. <laughs> it's just too much fun. Just... Good job, random guy. You're the worst guard in the existence of guards. <laughs> Nobody. Don't worry about it. Ooh, got up here just in time to see that. I'm just gonna... Yeah, this guy doesn't get to have a, uh, a nice funeral. I'm just gonna smash him into the wall a couple times. Th this guy, I don't know what... Oh, hey, I made a crack in there for a second. Um, I don't know what that guy did to deserve this, but, uh, well, I don't like him. Oh, here we go. Can actually get through here. Oh, there's a red force field there, so we can't actually do anything with that. But, hey, in theory, we would have been able to. Bypass everything! Get loot. And the express elevator back down. Wow. It's really interesting to, like, crouch, jump, and have to use low gravity all at the same time. Because it just is weird. <laughs> I 
I have an idea. Huh? Ah, that was manly. You, sir, are a genius. Oh, I can't break these because they're up. Ah, fine. Manliness. <laughs> I see him. Here's a little nugget for you. Ignore me! Oh crap, I went the wrong way. Come back down, please. Come back down, please. Thank you. Huh. Yeah! Listen, did you hear that? No, I didn't. What was it? Oh, what was that? I love how that just kills them instantly. Just blah, dead. <laughs> Probably has something to do with gravity fields and space-time inversions. Plus one if you get that reference. Damn it, I did it again! Oh, for Pete's sake. Get back down, please. Thank you. Going back up. It'd be nice if I actually... Oh, Jesus. That's the issue. I keep not jumping. Come back here. Where do you think you're going? I love that the other guy was watching the gun like, uh, uh. Again, okay, that's just the greatest thing in the universe. How did he get stuck to his butt? What was that? Don't ask questions. Don't ask questions. The various explosions are just the greatest tool in all of mankind. Oh my god, I, I could just use the G-Lift, but I'm having too much fun with the explosions. There's more explosion here. I feel like they know what I'm doing. Use dead body as projectile against everything. Eat Sky Police! Sky Police! Oh, dude, just flung him into the ground. Oh, 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 oh. I, oh, God. Hi. You shouldn't be able to see me. I've got some, some serious bad manners here planned. There you go. Hold that. There you go. <laughs> Oh, this is just horrible. I'm despicable. I am despicable. What's over here? Oh, Explosium! The game does know what I'm doing. It's just too much fun. Can you blame me? We. Oh, that's a wall. Look, loot. Wasn't even trying for that. Whatever. It's like Portal. We weren't even testing for that. What's up? <laughs> just, just. That's it. Everybody's going in the pit. Whee! <laughs> Enjoy that. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. just clipped his backside. Oh, damn. 
That didn't get him. I almost, I do kind of feel bad for these guys. Like, I, I don't almost feel bad for these guys. I do feel bad for these guys. They've apparently been vaporized. All right, then moving on. Moving right along from the vaporization of my enemies. <laughs> don't mess with Rochard. He'll vaporize your ass. Here's a little nugget for you. You should go investigate that dead body. <laughs> oh my god, I am a horrible person. <laughs> If there was any confirmation that I needed, it was this game right here. If, if that needed confirmation, then this game would have just confirmed it. I am... Also, their bodies are gone. Like I said, don't mess with Richard. He'll vaporize your ass. No. I said, don't... Also, I just noticed that the, when you die, the health bar icon goes from a man to a man with his head rolling away from him. That's disturbing. Did it again, didn't I? Screw all y'alls. Get out of my way. I don't even know what just happened. Oh, this looks dangerous. Ugh. Skylar, you okay? Katsina. Thirty years I've waited for this. Finally, my journey is complete. No, Maximilian, don't touch the statue! You don't know what you're dealing with! Ihuan Inhuan! Yehono Machihua! No! <laughs> Your weapons are useless against me! Right, what do we have John, to do here? They are somehow connected. Oh, the yeah, figures, the discs, and now Maximilian. Why are you even trying to fight me? Surely you understand. You cannot win. One down. Eat it. Oh god. It sucked up my friggin' explosion. You time, John. Never. Well. That doesn't really fit. Oh, come on. You have to open up right there and screw me up. Halfway there. Keep at it. So, basically, destroy these things, save the universe, you know. No big deal. I think that actually made it. I'm not entirely sure if that made it or not. Uh, meanwhile, throughout the battle, there are things. Just oh, one more to go. Uh, there's. Why are you even trying to fight me? Surely you understand. You cannot win. Ah, uh, go, 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 go. How there's explosium in this old ancient temple? I have no idea. Resistance is futile, John. John, get the disc. Plug it into the hell gun. Huh? What are you talking about? Just do it. All right. Damn, a perfect fit. Damn, what have you done? Get away from the disc! It's No, sir. It is mine. Also, I love. This is the, uh, something I was talking about with the G lifter. Or the G swing. Because, quite frankly, uh, this is amazing. Oh, come on, really? You gotta open up right in front of my explosion as I launch it?
Are you okay? I guess. <sighs> Skylar, how the hell do you know the disc would work with the Helga? Alien, Skyrig, Anti-Gravity, and Maximilian. Let me guess. It's all connected. Yes, it's all connected. Fifty years ago, Skyrig had a mine in Arizona on Native American land. They found something, and Maximilian was part of it. How'd you find out? Uncle Floyd was there too. Where is Floyd? That sound! Whoa! That's not good! No! And so we come to a strange, dubious, and confusing end. Ooh, this is that Grinders Blues song I was talking about. I'm going to shut up so you can listen to it. And also, roll the credits. Anyway, so I'll be back when the credits are over, I suppose.
And with that, that ends the uh, vocalized bit of the credits. Uh, I'm actually a little bit surprised it's still rolling. I forgot how long these were. I suppose it is technically a full-length game, so... I mean, it does... T it does the single-player campaign does take... Hmm, well, how long have we been playing this? It'll tell us at the end, but... Um, I don't know, the first time I went through it, it took me maybe four hours to get through total. Maybe five total, I'm not sure. Um, four or five hours. Uh, it's pretty decent for a puzzle game the first time you go through it. After, obviously, I've already done the game once, so I kind of know all the puzzles. I'm thinking from now on, whenever I do a puzzle game, I'll have, to, I'll have never played it before, so I'll have no idea what I'm doing. That way, it'll be much more interesting with me going constantly going, um, 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 I think maybe, um, put this here. Woo! It's over. Anyway, stuff like that. Um, credits still rolling. Uh, <laughs> I had planned for them to go on for this long, but, uh, <laughs> well, I'm just kidding. Obviously, I could just... I don't know if you could hear that, but something just fell over in my room. Uh, that would be my battery charger for various things like my keyboard and my mouse and my various game controllers for 360 and or PC. Um, not my headset. My headset has its own internal battery, but um, which, so by the way, if I haven't mentioned it before, which I know I have, I have a brand new glorious headset, so thank you to you know who you are for this headset. Anyway, um, <sighs> what to say about Richard? Well, final thoughts on Richard? Probably it's it still still feels like to me after playing it twice, I feel like there's more story there than what they told us. I feel like I'm missing something obvious that I should that I shouldn't be missing. Like it maybe maybe there's lore somewhere I can look up or read or something, but and now we come to the end of the uh, credits. Also, did anyone else notice in the thanks? There were a lot of Mikos. I mean, a lot. Um, so yeah, back after a obligatory ending, if you click continue game, it just starts a new game. So, actually I think it starts the credits, I'm not entirely sure. Um, how long did that take to beat? Can we check? I don't think we can. We can check how long we've been playing, though. Uh, we've been playing for 51 minutes this session. About an hour. That's pretty decent. Get two episodes out of that. Or just one. One really long episode. Um, anyway, wrapping up here, we should be going back to Dark Cloud 2 soon-ish, hopefully. Because Fraps is playing better with others. Hopefully. So hopefully we'll be going back to Dark Cloud 2. Um... After that, uh, I'll also, because I do like to run at least two series on my channel that are just me, um, Fallout 3 will resume, hopefully soon, uh, we actually get back together and record some more of that, um, I don't know what the next indie game I do will be, because, uh, one thing I like to do on the channel is always do at least one indie game, because I do love indie games, I mean, I just played one, thank you very much, um, I'm not entirely sure what my next indie game's gonna be, because there are a couple I've been playing, but they aren't really complete yet. It's one of the buy it early, support the development, and get uh, early access to alpha and beta copies of the game type thing. Um, there's a couple I've been playing, might do one of those. Um, if you're curious, it's Towns and uh, Starfarer, or Star Sector as it's now called. Um, because of the legal issues, they had to change the name. Uh, one is a town simulation. It's like, a little bit like a reverse RPG. Rather than playing the hero in the town, you play as the town, supporting the heroes uh, that go into the dungeon and do all the horrible things and will get murdered. Uh, um, and it's not at a complete state at the moment. Um, it is on Steam. Uh, now, I would like to defend the developers on this. It was just a slight miswording that they did, because a lot of people will give them flack about this, because they put it, they put, they got it on a Steam Greenlight, and it shot through the Greenlight process, because it had so much support. What people didn't realize is the game isn't done yet. And they didn't, 
exactly put that on the Steam green light thing that the game isn't done yet. They, uh, they, I guess because coming from, it's two guys doing it, is two people doing it. They used to have three or four, but now it's just two due to internal issues and whatnot. And basically, yeah, they got a lot, they got a huge amount of flack over just not saying that it wasn't done yet. People expected a complete game. It's not complete, but you can still play it. Um, uh, Star Sector or Starfarer, depending on if you're old or not, uh, Starfarer has been out for quite a while. Uh, well, it's been available for quite a while. It's not out yet, technically. Um, it is still very much in alpha. Uh, the vast majority of the game mechanics are not there yet. It is a space combat simulator at the moment. At the moment, it's basically just co space combat. In the end, when it's finally done, it should be something like... Oh, I'm trying to think of something to explain it as. A single-player MMO, if you will. Or a, just a space RPG, basically. You go around space, you do whatever you want. It's an open-ended RPG, so it's an ORPG, open RPG. Um, at the moment, like I said, it is just a space combat simulator, although the combat is really, really good. Someone just sent me a text message. Who dares? Ugh, I'll have to deal with that in a second. Um... So, yeah, um, the other one is, uh, the last game I'm considering is Don't Starve. Uh, there are several other games I've gotten in the Humble Bundle as well that I might do. Um, in a, most, in a more recent Humble Bundle than the one I did before that had Rochard in it. Um, mainly Closure, Snapshot, Splice is a puzzle game. I've considered doing that. Um... There's another one, too. Shank 2 is one I've considered doing. I've got that. That was in Humble Bundle as well. Um, Cave Story Plus, which, as far as I understand it, is an RPG as well. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what the premise is, but I know that a lot of people grew up with the earlier version of the game, and it is beloved by many, many people. So I might do that. Um, at least at some point. And, uh... So yeah, what I'll probably do is probably closure snapshot soon. Uh, mainly because I've been wanting to do them because they're puzzle games that I've really been wanting to be doing. Want, been wanting to do. Um, there's another couple indie games I've considered, but at the moment, well, yeah. Anyway, unless you actually watch these till the end for the sake of hearing me talk, well, you've left quite a while ago. Uh, and uh. For anyone that is still here, put banana in the comments. It'll really confuse people. Hopefully. Anyway. Anyway. Um. <laughs> just I just want to see a slew of bananas in the comments. But I mean I don't have the the viewer base for that much. But anyway. Uh. <laughs> just uh. You know. Anyway, that was Richard, and I've been Dead Videos, and I will see you next time. Good night. Good morning and a good evening.